How did I become to be president of the Players Association? It actually happened in Vegas four or five years ago, and I was there for our regular summer meeting and had no intentions on running for the presidency when a few players came to me and said, hey, Chris, we would like for you to do it. We need you to do it. And I said, whoa, well, I don't think I have that kind of time. It's turned out to be one of the best things I've ever done. I've had an opportunity to learn so much. It's really a position of service. You're about what's best for the entire group of players and something I wouldn't change for the world. A year or two ago, uh, we had no work stoppage. You know, we were able to come to an agreement with the owner's board, the board of governors, and continue to go out there and give the fans a reason to cheer for us. They're the reason why we do what we do night in and night out. I think the accomplishment or accomplishments that uh, we're most proud of uh, is, never, is never about me. It's about our uh, complete body of players and the things that we've had an opportunity to do together over the past few years when we decided to take our union back. We set up a health insurance for retired players. Every current NBA player at the time will at some point be a retired player. And these retired players now who didn't get the benefits of all the trainers and all the masseuse and all the different things that we have now, who bodies have been you know, worn down over years of, of hard work, they have an opportunity for health insurance for not only them, but for their families. Bringing in Michelle Roberts was one of the best things our union could have done because she's so selfless. She was all about uh, the players and, and making sure that we got a fair deal. And also, uh, she, she played a big role in having us understand our value. Uh, we're the most recognizable athletes in the world. Uh, we have players that travel around the country and as soon as they step off a plane or step foot in any country, they know who we are. And I think the players now uh, really understand that and the players have, have gotten an opportunity to get involved in so many different things other than just a game of basketball, whether it be entertainment, whether it be music, whatever it may be, uh, I think the players now realize that the sky's the limit.